What's up, guys? It's your favorite mentor, your one and only Forex Hero. Guys, today I'll be showing you just a simple manner of trading Euro USD the right way. You need to understand how to analyze and also be able to project or forecast the, the next moves. So let's not waste much of your time and get into the charts. As you know, guys, your Forex Hero starts by analyzing from a higher time frame. You need to know the bigger picture. As we know that we look at the bigger time frame and then scaling down to lower time frame so that we can see where that bigger move is showing us, where is it leading us going down a reverse pyramid type of situation. This is uh, something like this. So we start, this will be your higher time frame. Yes. Higher time frame and then this will be your lower time frame. Lower time frame. This one and yes. So this is just the manner of how we analyze. We start here, we end here, execute. Okay. So let me start by showing you guys how we, uh, this Euro USD is looking. We had nice moves and we had a very, very, very volatile uh Friday. So let's look at what is going as you can see. I can see the market is showing moves. Uh, of a downtrend you can see let's look at this one you can see the market is pushing down pushing down pushing down you can see the market is pushing down that's just how you see if the market is going down or up so we have this type of formation Okay, you can see the market is pushing down. And I'll start by identifying my highest point. My highest point will be this one, but also at, on this scenario, you can see this one was a uh, retest. The market came to fetch uh, little orders up there. So let's, look, let's use this one. And this one. And then this is a very sensitive key. Let me go to one week and see. We are able to see. Okay. So now I'm going to use this one as well. Because I can see we're pushing down. So you can see, wow, from the 2003 push up, then it's going back to 2003 others oh, wow wow so let's look at what is currently happening here yes okay you can see we're pushing down so let me draw my sensitive areas. See area of interest. Yeah. Okay. Okay, you can draw others here, but now the market is here, so you would rather not uh, have too much lines. Okay. Wow. You can see, guys, I can already see where the market is going now. Okay, it's not going to be easy when you start, guys, but with practice, it will become easy. Okay, so
looking what is currently happening now So basically looking at what's currently happening on the daily, I can see the structure showing us the moves going to the downwards direction. So now let's look at this. As you know, we can also draw our area of confluence and also here we'll have this structure showing us that it was a correction and then it broke to the downside. So I will use this as a very important resistance because you can see we are below it and now we went to retest it and we are pushing to the downside as well and the second part will be this one as well because i can see that this will be my next target okay now let's go to four hour the four hour the four hour time frame showing us that indeed we retested this level so becoming a stronger resistance now and then we are pushing to the downside so we can see what is currently happening and we can use this as well so you can see this is a correction of, of some sort showing us that the market pushed down and now it's correcting touched here and now if it breaks here we're expecting a, a mistake coming to this level so currently can wait for a break of this because now we don't want to enter a cell and then the market pushes up with us rather wait for a break and then take it all the way down we can have a sell stop okay now let's go to our execution third button okay so now we can see what we are looking at subsequent if we don't break and go down i'm expecting this type of situation push to the upside make the third touch before we push to the downside so this is just what i'll be looking at if we don't break here we push to the upside then my next uh area of confluence will be here because now i'll be looking I'll fo be focused more on getting the candlestick formation and also looking where this resistance holds. So on this one, I am currently in a bearish movement until we reach this point so that we can see whether it's giving us a reversal kind of nature. Because it's possible that we can reach this point in a descending market structure from something that looks like this. Let's see. We break, we go down, then it's possible that the market can do this tap and then shoot to the upside. And stay. So it's possible that the market can give us um, a double bottom here or reverse head and shoulder to shoot to the upside. So this is just my Euro USD forecast for today, guys. I wish you guys a very profitable week. Please do not forget to click the like, subscribe, and share button. And also share with your friends and families. From me, your favorite mentor, the one and only Forex Hero. Catch me in the next video. Peace.